insufficient deep neck extensors could contribute to neck complaints, which is why the cervical extensor endurance test aims to identify weakness of superficial and deep neck extensors. The head and neck past the edge of the table and the cervical thoracic junction stabilized, ask the patient to sustain a chin tuck position in neutral for 20 seconds. A positive finding for weakness of the deep neck extensors is an increase in chin length or losing the chin tuck, indicating a dominance of the superficial neck extensors of the neck. Weakness of deep and superficial neck extensors is indicated when the patient moves into neck flexion due to the inability to hold the head up. Sebastian et al. from 2015 report a change of 5 to 10 degrees from a maximal craniocervical flexion position to a relative craniocervical extension position for the deep cervical test and a flexion deflection of more than 10 degrees for the global test are considered a positive finding.